Oh. My. Why can't women put on eye makeup with their mouths closed? <laughs> God. No where I am, I can smell your perfume through these whispering pines. guys, so this is the long-awaited vlog that I've been talking about of my weekend in Tifton, Georgia. So last weekend, I was in Tifton, Georgia with my two good friends, Lillian and Donna, to go and see the vocal band Home Free. Now, Home Free is the most recent winners of NBC's hit show, The Sing-Off. And The Sing-Off is the show that really started other um, vocal bands such as Pentatonix. Scott Hoink, sing with me! And of course, Home Free is following suit, traveling all around the states, performing live in front of thousands of acapella addicts such as myself. I was able to go and see them perform live in front of all of us. But something that happened that was even more interesting was that I was able to go and have lunch with them. I was able to go and have lunch next to them at Ruby Tuesdays, the day before the concert, which was pretty sweet, and not gonna lie. And no, I totally didn't fangirl and take pictures of them as they were eating their food. But all in all, it was a good time, and I ended up taking a picture with the guys after lunch regardless. So after lunch, myself and my two amigos went and checked into the hotel and all that good stuff. So after that, we went back to the same Ruby Tuesdays where we had lunch with the guys and met up with a bunch of the other home fries who were traveling in from out of state to come and see the concert. You know, and that was really cool because we were able to actually put faces to the names and get to know each other. We talked about the guys and just let loose after a long, long day of being on the road. So the day of the concert finally came around and we were actually able to see Tim Robin Austin of, of Home Free in the lobby of the hotel they were staying. And that sounds really creepy now that I think about it. But we were actually there to just meet up with a bunch of the other home fries before the concert and also check into the hotel ourselves. But things didn't stop being creepy there. If you could say one thing to the guys, what would you say directly? If you had one question for the guys, what would you ask? Question? Yes. Question or one thing to say? Let's do a question. Favorite song to sing. Favorite song to sing. Okay. <laughs> You're on the all, spot. All of my questions are not appropriate. Okay. I'll leave it at that. Okay. <laughs> How about you over there? One question. There's one place you can travel to you can't get to. Okay, that is good. What is your most favorite thing to do when you're not working? Okay. Sleep. And then you, this thing? No. So I tried to vlog while I was down in Tifton, Georgia, but that didn't really work out. I get distracted easily. Hey guys, so I have not vlogged in forever. It's been about two weeks now, and so here I am back. I'm currently in Tifton, Georgia, where I'm going to go see the Home Free concert. Yay! And I've actually met them twice now. It's pretty cool. Um, we're staying, well tonight we're staying in the same hotel as them, and yesterday we went and had lunch with them, so that's really awesome. Um, I am here with my good friends. I have Miss Lillian over here. I don't know, if, can you see her? Yeah, you can. Hey. Awesome. And then Donna is in, in there doing things and talking. Doing yeah, doing her thing. And so, yeah, we're just waiting. We're about to go and work for the concert for a little bit, and then we are going to watch the concert and just chill.
but yeah, just want to give you guys an update of what I'm doing this weekend. I will be recording more at some point. Who knows, maybe. But yeah, hope you guys are having a fabulous weekend, and bye. So later that day, Donna, myself, and Lillian were able to work the well call table, and in exchange, we were able to get VIP passes to go and get autographs with the guys, as you can see here. Oh no, oh, yeah. this is... Well, <laughs> Away. Look at all these VIPs. Uh huh. <laughs> I like that. Well, those are Katrina, not Lauren. Hey, ladies. Hey. Hi. Yes, I am videoing. Videoing. <laughs> yeah. He does a vlog. Do a trick. Do a dance. dance. Twerk. Twerk for us. Uh -huh. No, we're gonna leave that to Tim. Okay. <laughs> we'll leave the twerking to Tim. Okay. <laughs> So we're about to go and see the guys. We are on the VIP package. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we're about to go to um, see the guys, and this is awkward now. So bye. I'll keep you guys updated. Really. <laughs> All the way in the back back there. And then came time for the concert. And you guys, it was fantastic. Luckily for you, I was able to catch a few little glimpses and clips of the concert. And so, yeah. Hmm. Oh, I guess this is the part where I put them in here. Okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but the main problem is that he's always had particular trouble approaching women. Luckily, this next song came out, and he now has a pickup line that works every time. <laughs>
out of seven dwarves are not happy. <laughs> So a couple weeks ago, we were on a cruise ship, and there was a woman on the very front row, and from the stage, I could just barely make out her t-shirt. And right across the front, in big bold letters, it read, Guess. <laughs> and so I was like, Implants. By the way, hashtag let Tim twerk. You're gonna throw your back out, Miley. <laughs> you scared me off the stage, man. I'm funny. It's okay. <laughs> that was not cool, dude. <laughs> so, at the very end of the show, the guy stood up and sang, God bless the USA. And you guys... Oh my gosh. And I'm proud to be in America And then this happened. So all in all, my weekend was a blast and I couldn't ask for a better first concert to attend. So guys, if you really liked this video, which I hope you did, please like and subscribe down below. Now if you also want to follow me on Twitter and Instagram, my addies are also down below somewhere, maybe, I don't know. But yeah, um, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, I hope to see you guys soon. I love you all, goodbye. Bye!